So this is Bog Pond Park. I don't know if it's Bog or Bogue, but it is an absolutely beautiful park in Bloomingdale, New Jersey. One of the really super nice things about this park is that the playground equipment is scaled to both little kids and big kids. So my son, when he was growing up, we were here almost every single day after school. And then as he grew up, he got to use all the different equipment. And then it's been a real treat being able to bring my cousin's children and you know watching all the kids in Bloomingdale grow up here through this park. I'm pretty sure what the story is, is that Glenwild Garden Center next door actually donated this land to Bloomingdale. Oh, it is bright out here. So this is Bog Pond, and every year Bloomingdale stocks Bog Pond with trout. They have one of the local fish hatcheries come, and they put a whole bunch of trout in here, and then everybody from town can come with their fishing pole, and then there's a fishing contest here. So we're super excited for that. This is a, a little free library at the park, so you could just look in there. I'm gonna, I'll climb in there. See, this is absolutely one of the greatest books. Mooba la la la, this was one of Jackson's very favorites. So this is so super sweet. You could come to the park and you could get a new book to read. And then when you're done with some of your books, you could put your books in here. It's nice and organized. Very, very sweet. So this is a little free book library at Bog Palm Park. That is adorable. And then the gazebo is so nice. Such a beautiful place to sit while the kids play. Just a nice place to walk around. Do you want to do something totally crazy and go see the otter hole? Sure. Otter hole is the first of uh, the waterfalls in Northern Green State Forest. Ah. There's Glen Wild Lake is on our right. So this is the parking area for, um, one of the parking areas for Northern Green State Forest. And this is actually a little short hike. We're in Bloomingdale that you could go across the street and there's marked trails that go up the mountain, which as much hiking and everything as I've done here, I've never done that. So that's definitely something that we need to put on the list of things to do. So since we have a couple of minutes, let's go check out the Otter Hole just to see how easy it is just seeing one of Bloomingdale's great treasures. So the White Center is 2.9 miles away. Ozio Rock, is that's the trail across the way. Chickahawkee is 1.1 miles, and then Winoki High Point is 2.6. All of the trail maps for Northern Green are online, and you also could buy copies of them at the Glen Wild Garden Center. Um, I like to use my phone with the trail maps, but having a, a paper copy is always an excellent idea. Um, it just helps you navigate a little bit. I actually, when I'm like hiking, hiking, I hike in um, bogs, which is like the neoprene boots because they're waterproof and they come up really high. And then I'll go through anything. I don't worry about, like, not the, I mean, you very rarely see snakes out here, but when you do, they're usually little harmless garter snakes. But like, I hike in high boots, even in the summertime, and then I'll just go through anything. I just put some inserts in there to give me some extra support, and they're the best hiking shoes I think that there are. Uh, this was worth walking in. A really short walk from Glenwild Ave, and we're right at the beginning of Northern Green State Forest. So, as a jumping off point, you start with the Otter Hole Falls. Chickahawkee Falls is about about a mile away, and then there's just endless hiking trails, including some really excellent views in New York City. And this is all in Bloomingdale.